Hall of Fame basketball coach Jim Calhoun is ready to step off the court. He announced he's leaving as head coach at the University of St. Joseph, and today he is telling us why. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Christian Colon talked with Calhoun and has that story from the West Hartford campus. In 2005, Jim Calhoun was enshrined into the Basketball Hall of Fame. He worked with teams like UConn and Northeastern and led them to success. After that, he came here to the University of St. Joseph and helped create their first men's basketball team. More than 900 wins later, Jim Calhoun says he's stepping down as coach to focus on spending more time with his family. We're in really good shape and no better time to leave a place. Not when you're losing, not when things are going bad, but when you're in great shape, and I think we are. Over the years, he's kept busy, many times winning more than 200 of those wins at Northeastern and 600 plus with UConn, his teams earning NCAA titles in 1999, 2004, and 2011. If you love something, you'll make sure, without question, that you'll find a way to get it done, and I have. I spent a lot more time with my players in my office and other different things to tell them about stories. Stories filled with advice that sent more than two dozen of his UConn players to the NBA. He was such a smart guy. You know, you, again, we didn't realize until you get out of there, but he cared about you. And the fight that he taught you to use was what he grew up with. After stepping down at UConn, he returned to coaching, this time the Blue Jays in West Hartford, a move that increased enrollment. His focus was not only the court, but ensuring his athletes succeeded academically. I think it's been far beyond just the impact of the basketball team. It got us that recognition uh, that we needed as we moved to become co-educational. A busy schedule Calhoun managed with stomach cancer. I'm still being scanned and right now, thank God, everything is great. And I've had a, this has been a five year battle, but right now everything is um, completely negative and everything is going great. Although he's leaving the title behind, Calhoun hopes to still work with UConn and St. Joseph students. In West Hartford, Christian Colon, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.